Well, sometimes I wonder if the people who come in here understand abstraction because it's been in Indian cultures and indigenous cultures forever. I know that people expect figuration from natives. They always expect something they can hook on to. But there are some of us who really see the in-betweenness of things, the, the abstract quality of life. This is the, the unseen, the, the things that you sense as spiritual, whatever your tradition is. This is called Yaki Flashback 2. The painting is about uh, my history as a Yaki Indian. And you might see forms in the painting themselves that reference, let's say, uh, things in nature like branches, serpents, uh, perhaps colors sometimes, um, materials in this particular one, uh, like the lace and uh, other things, glitter ribbon, when referencing materials that would be used sometimes in ceremony. Brooklyn is a real true reflection of the ener frenetic energy of the time in New York. and. But it is based on, again, on nature. I mean, you see in the painting itself, you see uh, planets, earth, uh, stick forms, uh, uh, let's say flowers, that big black flower shape. Uh, all those things are referencing really Yaki, pre-Christian beliefs. When I look at uh, my work uh, in relationship to other in native creativity, I also look at it in relation this obvious relationship to Europe, Western modernism, and also other cultures where, where I'm just part of a 40,000 year tradition. And that's a really great feeling to know that in your relationship to your work, that you're just adding and continuing the traditions. Yeah. Yeah.